Hello, this is Toxic, and this is um, episode 13 of Borderlands, I believe. Nothing good in any of these vending machines, so. Uh, in the last episode, I did a bunch of side missions to level up, because I wasn't high enough level to take on Mad Mel. And in this episode, that's precisely what we're going to do, take on Mad Mel. Uh, I already have the next few episodes planned out, so I know what I'm going to do. By that I mean just go murder the crap out of him, alright? Man, Scooter's such a redneck. Whenever you fight Mad Mel, sometimes you could miss this respawn point. Always get this respawn point. I've missed it occasionally, and it is just awful having to drive all the way back there. Drive in circles. Uh, Mad Mel isn't out right now, but what? How you get him to spawn is you just destroy. I think uh, two of his vehicles. I'm doing the same thing that I did to destroy the vehicles that one time. Just gotta. Where is that? Oh, there he is. You do not want to get out of your vehicle. You do not want your vehicle to explode either. Because this is a really vehicle driven battle. In this really small arena. That doesn't make any sense, but still. Back up. Now you just keep on shooting Mad Mel and driving in circles. Hopefully, I'll actually get this first try. Most of the time, I just drive drive like this and not even pay attention. Normally I just listen to music while doing this because it makes it go by faster. But I don't think that's the case right now. Ah, is there I know there's a button to look behind you. Up, oh, found it. Up, oh, yeah, Mad Mill's already at like less than half health. Oh stuff. Oh no! This is bad. Where? Oh! What you gonna do? Freaking killed Mad Mel without even being in a vehicle. I deserve a medal for that or something. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention how in the last video I sold nearly everything I had in order to buy a orange rarity weapon, the Combustion Hellfire. It is a very good SMG. It has really high elemental chance. And the Elemental damage is just amazing. God damn it! Up oh, there we go. I've never seen one of those vehicles leave the arena, so I'm just hopefully once I get out of here, I'm home free. Man. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'm home free. Now we can go to New Haven. New Haven! In only four minutes. That is great. That gives me just enough time to explore New Haven. Do a couple mission or er, one mission, I think, inside the city. I've received proof of Mad Mel's demise. Flat traps everywhere will rejoice. Please wait while I enable access to New Haven. <laughs> and yes. Yes. Just get in the car and travel to New Haven.
Once you get to New Haven is when like everything really starts happening. Like the big story part starts happening. I'm transmitting to inform you that I've made a decision I think you won't like. As administrator of New Haven, I am responsible for the well-being of its citizens. And in that capacity, I must keep the road to sanctuary closed for now. Baron Flint's tribe and that infernal contraption of theirs are out on the salt flats, and I don't want citizens getting killed trying to get past them. No, oh my God! Look at her face. Need a weapon with a scope. It's just so we can look at how messed up her face is. Ah! Robot arm. It's amazing. Once every two centuries. Two hundred years. Two hundred centuries. Two hundred centuries rather than two hundred years. Or did he say two centuries? I don't know. I can't even understand her. Now that I'm in New Haven, I gotta turn on all of the power supply places. I'm gonna do it backwards. Cause I already know where they are, so I'm going to do them in the backwards order. What's in this? Nothing. I'm also gonna accept this mission. But here's the north. Let me see. Rooftop is over here. There's also a chest right here. Let's see if I can. Ah, oh, crap. If I can jump on this. There's an easier way to go about this. I'm just taking the long way around. No! God ah, dang it. Now I'm out of the town completely. Gotta go all the way back to the entrance. God dang it. Can I climb up this? God dang it. Okay, rooftop power is right here. Tenement is over here. Uh, right here. While I'm over here, I can go get that clab trap repair kit that's right there. I go to Westgate. Running, 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 running. Did I miss it? No, it's scooters. Running, 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 running. This is the Westgate. Then, last of all, but should have been first of all, but I'm a rebel. Turn on scooter's power. There's scooter. He's awesome. Then we turn this mission into uh, Helena Pierce. Then we have to go look for some girl named Tannis. Uh, we were court. I got her echo recordings in one of the episodes. But the volume was too low, so he couldn't really hear it. My bad. Turn in that claptrap mission. Get an SDU. 21. Weapons, uh, backpack spaces now. Ah! This right here is hilarious. Yeah.
just how he gets that thing to knock down. Uh, the town of New Haven has a lot of chests just around the town. But I think it's because there's so many chests that the programmers didn't really want them bearing really uh, good loot. So they're all just mediocre, basic for... They're only good for if you just want to collect a bunch of the loot and sell it for a little bit of money. If you're looking for something that you'll use for a really long time, this isn't a very good place to do it. I would have laughed if while I was explaining that I found an orange weapon. Oh yeah, it's over here. Over here. Oh! E. I may have spoken too soon. This shotgun seems to have right charge. Only has two bolts though. My ammo regen even working? Yeah, it's working. Not very much though. I'm gonna go to Zed and see if I can find a very good class mod. See if I can find an even better um, support gunner class mod. What can I do for you? I can't forget. I can't buy directly from you. Marsh the med vendor. Found it. No. Is there not like a dispenser in the store? I thought there was. God dang it. What about Marcus's? Marcus has like a little store here. Right now here with the weapon gun. thing on the outside and has ammo on the inside. Right here, occasionally this door will open, that garage door will open and you'll find a, uh, a weapon vendor inside of there and it it's known for having a lot of rare loot in it most of the time. Sometimes it just has crap. But what you could just load it up to where it's here, to where the vendor's here. You can just sit here and wait for a while. It, uh, every time the vendors reload, they take roughly around 18 minutes to restock. And there's only less than a minute left, so I'm just going to run around town seeing what I can do. I'm just going to accept a bunch of missions real quick. Because I know in the next video I'm going to do a lot of side missions. I'm going to do a lot of side missions. I sh probably gonna, it's going to be the most side missions I have ever done in a video up up to now. Ah. Yeah. I'd like to have that SMG, but it's, I'm not like it's not like to die for. God dang it. Yep. Class mod. Well, I'm just gonna end the video off here. So this is toxic and see ya.